welcome back guys so as you can see have the card jacked up I'm gonna try and install the one Ali uh, canards <coughs> I'm gonna tell my boy to do it my friend damn that's just dirty to do it but because of this whole coronavirus going on lockdown uh, I'm actually going to try to do it myself I have removed this bumper before and I had tried to get it installed but for some reason I have to remove all the clips that are holding that frog light like oh, getting darker uh, it still didn't come off so uh, I'm gonna try my best do it again try to move remove the bumper again and uh, Give it another try The only thing I was afraid of just making the hose, but let's see how it goes. So yeah My sister's gonna practice riding her bike. Her bike's usually sitting in the garage doesn't ride it uh, She knows how to use it just Not a hundred percent ready to be on the like the main streets, but yeah, now that it's a lockdown, she should get some practice in, especially because she's not working. Let me know how you guys are doing with this whole lockdown. You know, hopefully this lockdown ends real quickly because it affected a lot of people. You know, people losing their jobs and stuff. But hopefully, you guys stay safe out there. You know, and yeah, so. Uh, I'm not gonna show you guys how to remove the bumpers bunch of screws uh, The next clip sh I should have the bumper off and then uh, I'll talk about You know what I mean that I could remove the bezel But so yeah, so see you guys soon in a bit So welcome back As you can tell Front bumper is off completely So I was over here fighting it This thing right here it's no joke. It kind of feels like it's glued in there. It took me probably like an hour and a half. Had to call Mo from Auto Addicts to give me a hand. But goddamn, it's no freaking joke. Luckily, I got it out. So as you can tell, it's the ZL1. This is the one Ali. I'm losing the fog light. Yeah, I know, but. Trying to get the more aggressive look. Hopefully later on, get a carbon fiber lid for it. One Ali, change the lower grill too. And yep, let's see how that goes. So let me get it going and I'll pick up the camera back up. So I was kind of able to put one in. This is gonna look. Look at that. Big difference. Can't wait. The only thing I do have to do, make holes for these to clip in, and that should be done. So hopefully it goes good. Can't wait, you guys. Can't wait. You could tell. Well, you can't retell really now. You could tell it's dark, and I only got one side still done. Uh, see a bunch of tools. I didn't have a, a Dremel to make the holes So I started using a blade I know you guys can tell but like I said luckily with this The canard covers it oh, Covers it so you can't really tell But yeah, so I, I gotta try to finish the other side by today try to get the whole car ready for tomorrow so uh, it's it's really complicated, you know. It's it's a pain in the butt, but I'll get it done, and I'll show you guys tomorrow how it looks when the sun's out. Cause I enter at eleven at work, so yep, I give you guys a little walk around how it looks. So far, it looks mean now. Can't wait. Good morning, guys. So it is a new day. It's about almost 
9 o'clock and I'm ready to head to work uh, but before I head to work like I said I'm going to show you guys how the car looks uh, by all means the cuts are not perfect <coughs> but that's how the car looks I do want to get the one Ali lip and the Lord grill. I don't know about the time. But I should lower the front too, huh? But yeah. There it is. What do you guys think? Look good? Should I get other stuff done to it? Whoa, well, dark. But yeah, drop it down below and let's see how what I decide to do next. Uh, please give this a thumb thumbs up for more. I'm telling you, there's gonna be more coming for the car, so stay tuned, you guys. Stay tuned. Now, oh. Love the sound. Alright, catch you guys later.